on the topic of building our studio, I want to talk a little bit about umbrellas. I showed you the example here how we have the flash head pointing into the umbrella. What does the umbrella do? The umbrella softens the light. I already mentioned that if we point the flash head directly at our subject, we get a very harsh, strong light, much like you put a flashlight in somebody's face. That's not very flattering when we're photographing models, mom, dad, Aunt May, whoever you want to talk about. We want to create a nice flattering look for them. So when you put the umbrella in front of the light, the light bounces off all sides of the umbrella and wraps around the face. It cuts down the shadows. You don't get those harsh chiseled shadows. You get very soft, fine shadows. It molds the shape. It brings out dimension in it. Now there are different types of umbrellas. This one is all white. Gives a very nice, as I said, soft reflection uh, of the light. A lot of the light is lost as it goes right through the umbrella. I mean, it's not 100% opaque. Some light is lost. You can get another type of umbrella, such as the one we have here. This one has a black coating on the outside. Virtually no light passes through the umbrella. Therefore, you've got almost 100% of the light bouncing back into, the, uh, into our subject. This is a real plus, especially when we're working with a 400 watt second power pack. That's not an awful lot of power to start with. So we don't want to be losing any out the back. Now the other difference, if you notice, between this umbrella and that one, is it has a silver lining. It's not quite the white one that we have here. It's a little bit brighter, a little more reflective. Again, it reflects a bit more light back onto the subject. So naturally you'd say, well, why would we ever want to go with the white one when we could just take the silver one? Because the silver one, it's a little bit harsher. Not much, but the shadows are a little bit, a little bit stronger. Um, you, you get a little more defined lines. This one is definitely a softer, more flattering light. Quite often an umbrella like this works better on, on an older um, subject. Somebody that may have a few lines in their face, a few creases. You may want to soften that. This one would work a lot better on somebody that's younger that has that smooth porcelain skin where you don't have those, those laugh lines, those wrinkles. It's going to be a little bit harsher.